How's it going? All right. The last one was tough. I'm not gonna sit here and lie. I will be most honest and say that the last one was kind of tough. Only because it was maybe... It shouldn't have been tough. It should not have been as tough as I am making it seem. Only for the fact it was only six wins, which is kind of, you know, not very much. That's not a lot of wins in BR, so but that's like the furthest I've made it kind of in a long time, if that's not embarrassing to say. Hey man, that would have been weird, all right? That would have been very strange if I just started taking BR extremely seriously, and then the very first run I was somehow able to get 12 and 0. I would have questioned many things in life, or just more than I already do, but that would have been maybe the highest question. I made a little bit of progress. I believe that I played a little bit better. I don't know how much better but a little bit at least you get better at everything you don't stand still you'd rise anyway this is not a foolish person mumbling this will be br i got eddie so one of them is down legitimately there's only one player i want to get now if i can somehow get donaldson man i really want to get that billy wagner This is automatically a redraft. I would have got Booker T to come in here and scissor kick me before I finish that. This is a lot better, yes. I don't even think you can go wrong with one of these picks, actually. Listen, I would love to take Dobie. I would. But I think that you have to take Bellinger in this situation. You really have no idea what you're getting yourself into. You can even put Bellinger's ass in the outfield. If this was somewhat of a year's previous and this was a previous version of Britain, you bet your ass I would be taking Britain right now and I would have somebody amazing for both sides. This guy is absolutely insane. This is like... Can you even imagine two better lefties? Every time I see this guy's picture, I get creeped out to death, but I may have to take him. Yeah, he is playing up today too. He doesn't have... That's not the vet, the vest. Yeah, the best variety of pitches. Like, what the, I could just, you know, get to a video where I can actually string together a sentence. That'd be great. This is a terrible gold round. Maybe awful. There is nothing good about this at all. I think Brian Roberts might actually be the best option. If I, you, yeah, fuck it. I cannot redraft. If this is the worst team for the rest of this draft of all mankind, I will play it. There's no way I can take Bellinger and Rios and then redraft. Well, fuck, I don't know, man. It feels like... Kelly Jansen still get lit up in this game. I don't know who the fuck this is, so I'm not taking him. It has nothing to do that he plays for the Orioles. I'm just gonna take Rondahl, probably. Wait a minute, who's this? Oh. Did Rosenthal just go silver? They moved Renfro's shit down, didn't they? There's no way Renfro only had 72... Yeah, they did. What the fuck happened to him? Yeah, I think Rosenthal might be the option. Thank God, actually. Holy shit. Corey Seager is only playing up, apparently. This guy has over 100 power today. Oh. God, this is like a damn round where I don't even know. It might be blatantly obvious, but I stink with Ottavino. And stink is... What the hell? Jose Martinez is hitting stats like this and he's a 73. Yeah, the field is... The field is 40. Fuck it. There's a lefty. When there's lefties, you take a lefty. Especially when you don't have one, I guess. Alex Dickerson. All right. Well, Corey was on the last one. This guy looks... Very mean, very ferocious and mean. 76 power can probably get the job done on the bench. Jose Martinez again, how you want me to take him or what? Yeah, he can be a bench bat. I do good with Dominguez or that's, that's not that bad. Or what? That's not that good, I mean. That is bad. I just said a 7.71 ERA is not bad. Am I drunk? I think that might have to be the option though because Wait a minute, they moved Hicks's power down too, didn't they? What the fuck is going on? Everyone's getting downgrades. Dominguez, let's go, buddy. Yasmero Petit. That is a name I have not seen in a while. Feels like it's been since last year since I've seen that. Or is Shane Green the option? Chris Archer sure as hell won't be the option. Petit has at least a variety of pitches somewhat. 50 velocity. Yeah, you're really blowing people away with that. This guy only has a two-seam, a cutter, and a slider. I don't think that's really getting the job done either. That was kind of a questionable silver round. Hold on a second here. Canna is actually... Or no. He's not a center fielder, that's for sure. You want to put him at first base, most likely, if you're going to use him. Well, a Phillies reliever playing down. What a surprise. I feel like that might be the case the rest of eternity. Wait a minute, I have a fuckload of lefties right now, too. If I took Canna, then this could probably maybe settled. Wait a minute, I need a whole nother outfield. What am I saying? I need three of those silver rounds to be outfielders, so I think I have to take Canna, and then maybe I'm going to need a, a, lef a lefty right now. I kind of mixed in silver and lefty together, but that would actually not be bad either. Didn't Russell Martin retire? 
Foxy's still in the game. This is also gonna have to be a bench bat because I need this to be either a lefty or somebody I can use in the outfield. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Oh, this guy is playing up today. That's not horrible or anything. That's somewhat usable. Holy shit. Randmill Reyes may have just saved the day. I got bailed out big time. Lefty just showed up now. Kike is not gonna play over Grossman, I don't think. Grossman's also a switch hitter, so then, wait a minute. I still have another silver. Oh, for the love of shit. Vida, you know what, buddy? I don't think this can be you. Yeah, my ERA is over 10 with Vida, so I don't know if that's gonna happen. Am I a dumb person? I might be a dumb person. Wow, did this actually kind of go all right? You couldn't find a damn soul in the lineup who isn't someone I kind of want to use. Oh yeah, except for Brian Roberts, never mind. Fuck him. But everybody else, yeah. I want to use everybody besides Brian Roberts. Everyone else, man, has like nasty power, kind of. Or wait, not nasty. Grossman's is decent, and then Grandal's is also... Well, that's actually not bad. I think leading off Bellinger is a smart idea. Since I have so much power in this lineup, I don't need to put him back in cleanup or third or something. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm... Yeah, I'm failing right now, kind of. I need to be moving... Ah, fuck. If Reyes could have played first, that would have been amazing. But Bellinger needs to be in center, and then Canna needs to be at first base. Yeah, that would have been a very bad fail. That would have fucking cost me, too. I guarantee it. Last play of the game would have been a fly ball that, you know, somebody with speed and good fielding could have got up to, and Canna would have missed it. There is nothing lacking on this team. This is like a Chick-fil-A menu. Absolutely nothing is lacking on it. I don't know, maybe since the new season started a couple of days ago, everyone's playing ranked, right? That's my only chance, I think. I didn't realize Danny Duffy was playing down. I probably wouldn't have started him if he was, but this guy is a common on the mound. I said I wasn't going to play here again for VR, but you know what? Fuck. It's going to get weird everywhere. There's no stadium that doesn't get weird. It just so happens that this one might be a little bit weirder than everyone else. Uh, yeah. Fucking bat was already at the pitcher's mound by the time the ball was released. What the hell? This guy may have swung at four pitches in that at bat. I'm lucky that didn't leave. Or is it? How did that stay in? Starting Duffy may have been the worst decision I've ever made in my entire life. Yeah, what what it what in the absolute fuck was I doing? I take back what I said. I take back that, you know, maybe I can get lucky and not face somebody like this. Alright. Fucking fine. Don't don't let that get down. Somebody catch it. I've seen leads evaporate like the condensation on the windows in this mode. Right, it's time to fucking wake up. This guy's throwing 95. Somebody keep something fair. Somebody keep something fair, please. Yes. Maybe? Oh, fucking chance he was catching that. This is going to change. Too high. Oh, get out of the fucking stadium. I was gonna bring somebody in. Hopefully someone else that stinks. Oh, fucking dog shit. How many times I gotta get the fucking runner in scoring position and then leave his ass stranded? That needs to be a future stat in this game. Or is it a stat that you can keep track of? Runners left stranded. Or do you even want to know that? I'd probably go upstairs and cook a bag of ramen noodles. Pour the fucking past on my head. Look less foolish than every time up at the fucking plate with runners in scoring position. Guys hitting amazing with everybody from what I'm seeing. Kind of forgot what mode I was playing for a second. I probably should have taken him out of batter sooner. This guy's batting like 600 with every motherfucker in his lineup. Yes, he fucking did. Come on. What in the fuck is that? Wake the hell up, man. This is fuck. I know it's late, but you gotta wake up. Thought that was crushed. Jesus! Just don't fucking ground do a double play. If I can get somebody up from the bench, this is good. Or walk them even better. That's gonna get down! 
That's a big hit. Jose Martinez, huh? Is he gonna be the hero? I need a clutch hit. That's it. He can't throw a strike now. I would say green light, but no. I don't want to fucking ruin this. Yeah, he walked him. I'm kind of nervous. This is Bellinger's time to shine. I couldn't have got pitching like this in the first inning. If I was fucking getting swings and misses like this, I wouldn't have been in a situation. Fuck off, Piazza, you fucking idiot. Oh, Jesus, fuck. He actually put that in play. Alright. Gotta believe. I just need JP here right now to tell me that there's a chance. Yeah, my ass, I'm stretching that. I'm not entirely sure what these moves are. He's bringing in righties against lefties and lefties against righties. Come on. Tie the fucking game. No. You don't swing at garbage. He might not even have confidence right now. If he gave up a leadoff home run, there's no way this guy has confidence. I was teeing off on that. I knew I was getting a fastball. I wish that would have left. Now a ball mine to the right side. He, he would have turned that if he didn't throw it. Get up! I smell the walk off! What a fucking win. What a win. It's a big win. You know what? Since everyone else is doing it, I'm going with the opener. I've seen that a lot lately. Let's see if I can do it and see if it works out. He has Edwin. I'm scared already. Judge and Ortiz. Oh, he fucking also has that Rios. Did he even set his lineup? Yeah, he did. He did set his lineup, I think. But I'm not really sure if where certain players were batting made really much sense. Come on. What the fuck is that? He's not getting away with two fucking terrible pitches. Not a chance. No way. Right. No early leads for him. I may have just walked the first fucking guy on four pitches and none of them were even close. I think I remember now why I didn't want to take Dominguez. Because not a single motherfucking pitch is located. Oh yeah, here we go. Fuck off, buddy. Sit down, goofball. Again. I think any pitch was where I wanted it. Oh my god. Thank god this guy wasn't on any fastballs, all I'm saying. I think starting Dominguez was maybe the worst. I would have rather started Duffy again. There is too many good bats in this lineup right now. There is. For this to go to shit. That didn't hit him. Yeah, no shift today. Or at least for that battle. Oh my fuck! My oh god! That was very weird off the bat. Can I. Again? Alright then. Thank God Brian Roberts has shit all power, otherwise that would have been right to him. Come on, man. I need, like, ten more runs to feel safe at least. Just Coors Field, too. You fucking... At least run it out. At least move your damn ass. Jesus, this guy is just really not on fastballs. But I don't want to give him just fastball after fastball, because you know for a fact one of them will be turned on. Or maybe not. Yeah, that's what you probably don't want to throw. That's like the definition of what you don't do in a situation. Every damn... That's going to get down. Every damn at bat, it's only been like three. I've been jammed with Bellinger. 
I should have fucking shit on that. That's embarrassing. At least cash him in. That's the least you can do. That'll be better. That will be shattered to the moon. It came back down. Somehow that got down. Well, here we go. Here we go. The ever so interesting bottom of the last inning of the game. That's a nice pitch. Very, very nice. This guy has his thumb up his damn ass, too. This is like complete opposites of opponents. The last guy was maybe on everything. This guy might just be fucking around. This guy might just be playing in a fucking jar of marshmallow fondue. I was smelling an error. I was smelling an error and then a rally, but no, nothing. Nothing at all. I don't know why Dominguez is strutting out to the mound like that. He had an awful outing. Thank you.